Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Sunny here. Uh, shaved, but anyway, um, my last video um, was about um, you know this TNA match of uh, James Storm versus Matt Hardy, which is horrible. Anyway, um, <clears throat> making a video. WrestleMania is Sunday. WrestleMania 31 is tonight. So I'm gonna make a quick video um, about. I, I guess my predictions in another video, but I left out a few matches. Um, so I'm gonna go back in there. Yeah, I cut my fill. Ah, uh, anyway, uh, so I'm gonna go um, and, and tell you guys who I think's gonna win. I wrote them down right here. Um, I'm uh, in the in the tag title match. I'm gonna go for the Usos. Um, I think that they're a really strong tag team. Um, so I'm gonna go for them um, to to win to to win the titles on that one. Um, also, we got. Um, Mr. Money in the Bank, Seth Rollins, taking on the Viper, Randy Orton. Um, and I am going to go for the Viper, Randy Orton. I believe that Randy Orton is just stronger. Um, he's too strong for um, Rollins. Um, so I think, uh, you know, uh, the authority will get in Rollins' head. And uh, I think that the Viper will come out with, you know, with vengeance on his mind. And he's hungry and he's ready for a victory. So I'm going to choose Randy Orton on that one. Also, we got in the Divas Tag Match, we got AJ Lee and Paige versus the Bella Twins. I'm going to go for the Bella Twins just because of what happened on Raw last week about AJ Lee and Paige. They're a little scuffle. So I'm going to go for the Bella Twins on that one. Also, you got the United States title on the line. The champion Rusev taking on, well, I'm going to go ahead and say it, the Grand American John Cena. I believe that John Cena is hungry for a title, so I'm going to pick John Cena to bring back the United States title back home to the United States. So I'm going to go for John Cena over Rusev. Um, also, we got the um, the um, let's see here. We got the Undertaker versus Bray Wyatt, and I am going to go ahead and I'm going to choose the Undertaker, the Phenom, the Dead Man. Um, I know last year Lesnar ended his streak, so I am going to go for um, um, Undertaker to Tombstone Power Driver, um, Bray Wyatt, and shut his mouth. I, mean, I, mean, I like Bray Wyatt, but he just, the Undertaker needs to put him in his place. I do believe this is going to be the Undertaker's last WrestleMania. Um, he's just getting older, and he can't take it no more, so I'm going to go for the Undertaker. Uh, the Andre the Giant Battle Royal. I am going to go for Kane. Um, not really a big fan of any of them in there, um, but one of the biggest ones that I really liked uh, watching when I was growing up was Kane. So, and I know he's part of the authority and all that crap now, but I am going to go for Kane on that one. <clears throat> we got the Intercontinental Championship ladder match. Um, seven men, you know, like Daniel Bryan, um, R Truth, um, Stardust. Um, uh, bad news, uh, Barrett. But I have to go for our truth on that one. I think our truth is hungry for a title, and I think he's going to win the Intercontinental Championship. Um, let's see. And we got Sting uh, versus the game Triple H. Um, many are saying that it's going to be Sting's last match in a ring period. Um, but, um, I think Sting, uh, will stay, uh, with WWE for a while. He signed a contract with him. I, I'm not for sure how long the contract was, but I know that he did sign a contract with him, uh, obviously cause he's in a match, but, uh, I'm about to go for Sting. I haven't seen Sting, you know, seen Sting wrestle in about 15 years. I, I mean, I saw him make, you know, appearances on TNA and stuff, but I never really watched him. So I'm going to go for Sting, um, on that match, um. You know, if the authority don't interfere, you know, interfere Stephanie McMahon will interfere, I'm going to go for Sting. But uh, I think he's too much. And then you got the, what I'm going to assume is the main event uh, for the WWE World Heavyweight title. Uh, you got the champion Brock Lesnar taking on the challenger Roman Reigns. Um, you know, Roman Reigns, he's strong, he's tough. Lesnar has one of the greatest managers of all time in his corner and Paul Heyman. Um, but I'm going to have to go for Roman Reigns on that one. I think he's hungry for a championship. Um, 
I think that he deserves this title. Um, but Brock Lesnar also signed a new contract with the WWE saying he's out of MMA fighting. So I don't know. I mean, I want Roman Reigns to win it. I think he will, but you know, WWE's going to have their way with it. So Lesnar will probably regain his title um, on that one. But yeah, come on at 7 o'clock tonight. I'm so excited, pumped, ready for it to go ahead and start. Um, wish I could have went. It's in uh, San Jose, California. So, uh, thanks to 49ers football stadium, Levi Stadium. Um, but anyway, I'm so excited about it. My favorite match on there is, is going to be Sting versus Triple H and the ladder match. Um, <laughs> anything can happen in the ladder matches. So I'm so excited about it. But thank you guys for watching. Let us know in the comments below which match you guys are most excited about. What your predictions on the... Also, uh, add us on Facebook, Sonny Dallas Morrell, um, Twitter, you can find us on there, and also on Instagram. But thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, favorite. If you're new to the channel, check out our videos, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.